So we're here in lovely San Jose. We're here to do a podcast, the Mind Pump podcast with guests on that show. And then we're going to record the Boxer Life podcast with them guys as well. So the fitness gurus, they're all shredded. They're all, <laughs> they're all IFBB uh, ex-pros and competitors. They, they know their stuff. Yeah, they know the stuff, so it's going to be interesting. I told Kev if it gets too technical, I'm going to pass the questions on to him. So I can't answer that Let's see stuff. See if we can fake it till we make it. <laughs> yeah, right. But first, we've got to have a coffee. A little tip for small businesses that don't know about Facebook groups. You can do private groups on here and with just your employees in then you can share messages, share different content, ideas and things like that. And for us I'd say it's, it's going very well, right? It does, yes. It's, it's definitely uh, not a traditional way to communicate with employees but it, it's effective because everybody's on Facebook. So. Yeah, and we're, we're like kind of moving with the times now, like back in the olden days, I don't know, what would we have done back then? Email. Email. Uh, serves. And then have meetings for every little thing where now we can just put new information on here if there's a change in the in systems or a change in anything. Like example is here, Kev's wrote on here about do we have any trainers that can speak French because we've got a potential client. So rather than texting everyone, we put it on there and then the trainers that can speak French, they'll get in touch and they'll get the client. I think this is the right place. I hope so. This must be it. Oh, How are you, boys? Hey, 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 How are you? 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 Your shoes are hairy too, You're bro. passionate. Yeah, bro. It's like real They're hairy too. It's real. Is that real? Is that real cheetah skin? Oh, shit. Yeah, right. So the guy you're here now talking about hairy shoes. He's <laughs> talking about Adam's hairy shoes. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. And that's Adam speaking. And over there we've got Justin. Justin, that's right. Hey, what's happening, man? Yeah. So we're here. Great to be here. In the beautiful San Jose in this amazing podcast studio and alongside of my business partner, Kevin Watson. That's good, good man. Yeah, good. so that's Kevin's voice. Good. So now we've got everyone's voice. Recognition. Yeah. Boys, how's it going? Good. Excellent. So this here is our, our nitrogen tank. And this obviously is our tap here. <laughs> it's, it's like a Guinness, isn't it? It's totally, it's totally. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of similar. So we have uh, some kegs in there. And it just infuses it with nitrogen. Nice. And so you get a different feel, but it's not like carbonation. Now. Right. Look at this coffee. It's like a little Guinness, he said. It is better. That's one of the things I didn't like about Horror Theory was that what ends up happening, and you know this already from running these group classes, like getting one on one coaching from you is nothing compared to group settings. So the fact that you guys have four coaches running, yeah. that's a lot better. Yeah, and I mean, we see a lot of benefits for that, but it's not even though so much of the overhead thing, but it's more finding good quality trainers and, you know, employing those trainers. How many trainers do you guys have underneath you right now that are currently at the two facilities? It's like 32, 33. Oh, wow. So there's quite a few of them you guys are yeah. yeah. What do you think, Kev? Incredible, man. Very uh, unique experience there. Kind of gives you a little insight into where things can go. It's pretty exciting. Yeah. It sure shows like how hard they've worked and, and what they're doing. They're doing something that I've never heard of in the fitness industry. Have you? I have not, no. I mean, Very we've, unique. we've heard of different, obviously, online certification courses and things like that. But these boys have got this podcast that they're getting a million downloads a month and they're making some passive income, which is fantastic. Yeah, and good. I think the, one of the best things was they're all down to earth guys, yeah. good, good yeah. fellas, and they're great to be around. It really shows you kind of where the, I think where the fitness industry is headed and, and how you can really maximize your potential, your exposure and income. How are you, mate? Good, how are you guys? Good, thank you. Just the airport, yeah. 
me, I'm going to talk into this camera so you can just ignore me. Alright. So we've had a great trip at San Jose. Now we're going back to the airport, back to Box and Burn. Feeling motivated, eh, Kev? Ready to get back to work. A little power nap first. <laughs> <laughs> motivated off the boys at my pump. Uh, they've given us some good ideas, but some of the things that they were seeing has really got mine and Kev's creative juices flowing. And I think we're going to uh, start doing some new stuff with the box, with Box and Burn and the Box and Burn Academy. Definitely a lot of fresh ideas, new ideas. Uh, Excited to see what we can do. Also, going to blow this podcast up. If you're not listening to the Boxing Life podcast yet, on iTunes and SoundCloud and YouTube, get on it. I'll put the link below as well for the Boxing Life podcast. This is the first time I've ever flew into a city and out of a city in one day.